Hi friends. Um, if you can go ahead and say hi, let me know that this is set up um, correctly and you can hear me. That would be helpful. I'm going to check the computer really fast, make sure that I'm actually live. So um, I hope you're all having a fabulous day today. Um, it's another wonderful day here in the craft room. And yeah, it looks like we're live. Oh, yes. Perfect. Awesome. Okay. Very, very good. Um, if, so if you're watching, go ahead and say hi. Um, and where you're watching from, give me a thumbs up or a heart. And um, then we can go ahead and get started. I know the background looks a little bit different if you've been watching every week. Um, do we have any newbies out there, though? Like any first time um, crafters or first time to so fancy? Oh, hi, Lisa. Hi, Mary. Thank you so much. Awesome. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Hey, Sabrina. How you doing, girl? <laughs> All right. And we have Deborah and Karen from Illinois. Deborah's from Virginia. Awesome, awesome. Okay, we've got all our friends here. Um, and yeah, so what I was saying is if, oh, Karen's a newbie on this site. Thank you all um, for being here. Welcome. Um, my name's Lindsay for So Fancy, and um, I like to do a little... Um, uh, project every week and um, so today's a little bit different because I know um, I've got a different setup going because my husband and I um, we bought a house yay adulting um, but we were moving all yesterday and so everything's in boxes and uh, you know we're just kind of like super tired but you know crafting waits for no one so I dug out a few things and um, we're gonna go ahead and do a project so um, today is also the launch of the big, um, wooden sign SVG bundle. And, um, uh, you know, if you love wood signs, then I think I found, not me personally have found, but, um, uh, I didn't discover this technique, but, um, I've been doing HTV on, um, my, on the round wood sign. So I got my heat press over here. So that's warming up. And... Oh my gosh, it's so fast, it's so easy. So let's go over to the craft desk. Um, oh, thank you. Um, oh gosh, is it uh, Qola? Did I say that right? Thank you so much, awesome. Suzanne, she's new from New Jersey. Um, Karen's saying, I need to get my Cricut to work. Yes, well, is it out of the box? That's always step number one, get it out of the box. <laughs> All right, so I'm actually going to flip this uh, camera around. Let's see if I can figure that out. There we go. Okay. So yeah, this is a little bit different than what we're used to, but we're making it work. So, um, I got this wood round, um, just off of Amazon and it's about 10 inches across and I painted it with, uh, just some white chalk paint. And now I'm going to press HTV onto it. So I just use some uh, silver uh, Caesar Easy Weed. Cut it out with my Kami over there. But um, you can use your um, Cricut. You can use your um, Brother Scan and Cut. Um, all the SVG designs um, are, you know, uh, able to be used on those machines as well. So this one's the Home Sweet Home. And what I decided to do is I wanted this um, to kind of come off the edge here. So I'm going to show you how I did that. I didn't know if it was going to work, so I didn't want to do it on camera. <laughs> you know, I think if I had been on camera, it might not have worked just because somebody was watching. But um, what I did is so this was a big piece of big piece of the carrier sheet. Flipped it over, and then I took my craft knife, and this is a, a I'm sorry, a, what reseal, not resealable, um, self healing mat. Yeah, so then I could just take the knife all the way around the edge and cut off the extra. And so there's those little bits there. Um, and so I just cut it off that way. And so now it's stuck to the front and ready to be pressed. 
Um, I'm going to go ahead and press this and then after that I'm going to press this home sweet home in the middle. And this is bl just black um, Caesar Easy Weed. Oh hi Tammy, thanks so much for being here. Okay, so let's go over to the heat brass. So Caesar Easy Weed, here it is, <laughs> my printer's on the floor. Yeah, nothing to set up, <laughs> but we do have the heat press going. Um, and you can see it's at two, I set it to 275, which for Caesar Easy Weed is low. Um, normally if you're going to be pressing this on a t-shirt, um, you know, or other like fabric substance or, you know, substrate, then you would press it at 305. Um, but the thing is with um, pressing on to like heat sensitive, um, you know, materials, then you want to lower the heat. So we're at 275. And then um, I also want to make sure that I am protecting um, the bottom platen. So if you've got a tough, you know, a tough one sheet or some parchment paper, Cut some of that out and put it onto your, um, onto the plat. And I should have checked the pressure before I started, and of course I forgot, but <clears throat> um, you would want to um, check that the pressure is correct and that it's not too, not too much because uh, you just need a light pressure. The thing is with these clamshells, so this is going, this is the clamshell, and so it's going to like, you know, come down like this. And so what's hap what's going to happen is the, the side here, this, this H and this O are going to get more pressure than this M and this E. Um, and so to avoid that or to account for that, we're going to press it quickly um, this way. And then I'm going to flip it 90 or 180 degrees and um, uh, just quickly press it again so we can kind of even out that pressure. Now, if you were using um, a swing away and where the plat, the top platen just came straight down, um, you wouldn't have to do it this way. Um, but these clamshell models, that's what you want to do. Um, and you also want to protect the project as well. So I'm just going to put a piece of parchment paper. You could do your tough one sheet over there. And then um, I'm going to see, I think it's the right pressure. It's a little, it's a little tight. So I got this knob um, back here. This is the Starcraft heat press. And so this knob you just turn um, and it's going to loosen up the, the pressure a little bit. So I should have done this before, um, but I was so excited that I just wanted to get started. And what I'm looking for is I don't want this to be hard to press down. So you want it relatively easy to close. Let's do one, two, let's do three seconds like that. All right, and then I'm gonna flip it over, or uh, not flip it over, flip it around 90 degrees, um, so then I can press um, the bottom here with that same pressure that was going to get, was at the top, so push it down. Remember, I'm at 275, so this is a lot cooler than um, normal Easy Weed. Uh, which would normally be 305. Okay, so then we're going to pull this off. Perfect. Lovely, lovely. Awesome. Now, um, I do want to uh, just warn you, I have pressed on these at 305, and they're so thin that it's... Um, it, if you've got a very thin material, it may warp, and I have warped these, um, but lowering the temperature to 275, that has helped considerably, and it stayed um, very, very straight. So perfect. All right. Um, so that was 275 um, degrees Fahrenheit, and then um, like three seconds on the top, flipped it around, three seconds. And now we got that second piece. 
the home sweet home. And the, what's nice about this design, um, this design is in the uh, big wood sign bundle. And that has just launched today. So for you um, that are watching, um, I'm going to remind you that um, you can get 15% off. So the, the design or the bundle itself is already 87% off um, with the 28 design. Um, and then until, um, um, I want to say what day, what day, what day, what day, you can get, you can get an extra 15% off with the code. I put it in the description of the video. Let me pull this out here. All right. So it, it um, here we go. Here we go. All right. So it's in the, it's in the description of the video. You save an extra 15% off the bundle. Um, I'll get that in just a second. I want to finish this. Um, but this one's cool because you, um, have the, the knockout design here. And so it's really easy to line up. Just kind of figure out, there we go. That's where the pieces go. And then just kind of, you know, do your best to line that up. What's nice with HTV is that you can reposition it like this. If I was using adhesive vinyl, yeah, that's one and done. <laughs> you stick it down. Um, it's going to be a lot more difficult to um, get up. And what I'm finding is that I'm able to line up this part, but this part is not lining up the way I want it. So I'm just going to cut that so I can line them up separately. <clears throat> So that, yeah, that one was good. Ooh. Um, let's go ahead and then do the sweet. Put that in there. And I'd probably be doing this on my work surface, but whatever. I'm going to do it right here at the heat press. There we go. So that lines up a little bit better now that I can adjust it by itself. And if you're like me, you're going to fiddle with it for about half an hour <laughs> before you uh, put it exactly where you want it. But you know what? I'm just going to go for it. You don't want to see me winding this up forever. There we go. Okay. <laughs> right, and then this last one. And this last one goes right there. Perfect. And since this design is just right here in the center, then I'm not going to worry too much about flipping it or rotating it. I'm just going to go ahead and press for about three seconds. That was, that was four, but I think that will be okay. And then I can peel this up. And I did get a little bit of the carrier sheet lines. You can kind of see those. Well, on camera, it's not picking it up as much. You can kind of see that where that carrier sheet was. So I'm going to try and flatten that out by pressing it again. And I could have avoided that if I had maybe just pressed it for like one second, maybe two, peeled off the carrier sheet and then pressed it for another couple seconds. Three seconds left, so hopefully that, even that out. Oh yes, 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 perfect. It did that, it evened it out right up there. And then there you go, it's your um, HCV wood sign um, and I like how it comes off the edges like that. That was fine. Perfect. Okay, so that's all I had. I'm gonna um, flip the camera around here. Let me, there's the box for my cameo. All right, here we go. Oh, there you <laughs> go. Awesome, awesome. Okay, so um, big wood sign bundle.
Um, and today's the first day it's launching. So, um, you can save an extra 15%. Um, I've got the code in the, uh, uh description and it's, um, wood signs, but without the I. So check the, dis the, the description. Um, and, but that's for a limited time only. So I'm going to grab that, um, while you can, but, oh, thank you. Is it Shavana? Thank you. And Latanya, thank you so much. I know, I love this. Turned out pretty cool. And of course, I was talking throughout the whole thing, so it seemed like it took longer than it really did, but super fast, super easy. Totally love it. Um, you just wanna make sure that you lower the temperature and then reduce the pressure. So there you go, my friends. Of course, if you have questions, please, please let us know. Um, if you, um, you know, make a design and a creation of your own, then please post it in our Facebook group or on our Facebook page here. Um, because we love to see what you're working on. Um, and you know, it's always fun. We're, we're all crafty here. We like to see what everybody's doing. So, um, thank you, Karen. Oh, Deborah, thank you. All right. So that's all I had. Um, enjoy the rest of your day and we'll see you next time. Bye friends.